All right, so let's read through this sir, and then you can sign off. So, has an optometrist or physician ever advised you that you require corrective lenses to improve your visual acuity to see at a distance? Yes. Yes. Has a physician ever advised you that you suffer from any of the following medical conditions? Heart disease, stroke, diabetes, epilepsy, seizure disorder, loss of consciousness or awareness, or any other medical condition no. or physical disability that may affect your safe operation of a motorized vehicle? No. No. And sign in the box here, sir. And then when you're finished, you can just click done with the pen and it should save the image. Okay, sir. Yep, and then we can read through this and then we're going to go. So, before we start the road test, I'll read you some important information. You will not be asked to do anything contrary to the law. Your driving capabilities will be noted and assessed during this test. You will be expected to obey all rules of the road, speed limits, traffic signs, traffic signals, and signal any changes of direction. All instructions will be given well in advance. When observing or looking around, please move your head and not just your eyes. You are expected to perform all required maneuvers. All cellular and Bluetooth devices must be silenced or turned off and must not be used at any time during the test. After the test, you can obtain a copy of the results sheet inside the office at counter A or by printing directly from the drivetest.ca website. Do you have any questions about the test before we start? No, yeah. I'm okay, sir. So when it's safe and when you're ready to go, we can turn to the left when safe. zone so you can speed up to 50. Yep. And then from this first street we're going to turn left behind that car. This will be a uh, 50 zone. Yep. And then you can main change left when safe. Yep. And then go straight. And we're going to stay in this lane. And we're going to turn left at this traffic light from this lane.
then this will be 70 zone. Then this first street left Wednesday. stop beside the first car sir this black mercedes you can stop beside it and we're going to parallel park behind this car the driveway you're going to assume is a curb for this purpose okay yep and then parallel park when safe And then when safe, go straight. When safe, okay. go straight.
Yep, go straight. And then from this first street, turn right. Yep, and then stop in front of the second tree, sir. This is tree number one. Number two is over here where that green box is with the yellow numbers. Pull over, yep. And then from this position here, we're going to do uphill park with the curb beside us from this position. So oh. assume the road is up. Okay. What do you need to do? I will do the left, left side. Yep. And then park here. Break. And then I will, I will pull this one. Yep. And then when safe, go straight. When safe, go straight. Stop at the second tree, sir. This can be tree number one. Number two can be over here. Over side. Yep. And then from this position here, three-point turn using only the road when safe. Okay. Three-point turn. Then from this first street, turn left when safe. This first street, turn right when safe. Turn right when safe. Go straight, 40 zone. Then this traffic light, turn left. So just go straight in. Yep, go straight up, sir. Follow the curves, go straight. Yep, turn left. Yep, and then this is going to be 40 zone. Or 70 zone, sorry, 70 zero. And then we'll 
follow the black car in front, turning right at this first street. And then any parking space on the right hand side, sir, you can front park here. Any space, doesn't matter. Yep. Yep, yeah, something like that. So yeah. should I correct this one? No, just put it in park. Fine, sir. It says you did meet ministry standards, so you can just bring your license inside the office oh, to counter A. Okay. 